Hello there. The latest poll from YouGov on Westminster voting intentions shows just how strong the Brexit mood is out there in the country. The latest polling data from YouGov on how people would vote in a Westminster election is an indicator of how solid the Brexit feeling is in the UK. In this graph I have shown the last three polls, with the latest for each party being the blue bars on the left of each party set of three, the previous week's poll results in the middle of each set in green and that of two weeks ago on the right of each set in yellow. Straight away you can see that the Tories are in the lead and on a bit of a rise having increased their popularity in both the last two polls. Now whether that's down to a Theresa leaving lift or a potential Boris boost or maybe a Jeremy Jackup or even a combination of all three, who knows. But it is evident from what the leadership candidates are saying that the Conservative Party is taking a firmer position on Brexit and now we see a rise in polling. Any rocket scientists out there like to comment on any possible connection between the two? Now I had previously thought that a Tory rebound might take a bit of the wind out of the sails of the Brexit party as support shifted back to the Blues, but the Nigel Farage project looks untroubled in second place as it maintains its support. The Lib Dems in third place seem to have had a very small slide overall since the first poll, but in all the party of Remain looks to be holding up. It is the Labour Party now in fourth place and matching its own record low that looks to be the main casualty here. Now it is flirting with a more Remain and second EU referendum policy stance, its popularity is dipping. Message to Jeremy Corbyn, it's never too late to restate that Brexit remains the party policy. And this is the problem for Corbyn, as many within the Labour setup want to remain, while many of its usual voters and supporters want to leave. The Greens are still around the 10% ballpark, and all the rest are in a pool of about 6%. But the big point for me is the strength of the two parties that are now standing on strong Brexit platforms. And from these numbers it looks to me that if anything it is the support for Remain that is showing signs of a bit of a crumble. But this is only a poll and therefore just a snapshot of the feelings of a very small number of voters. And a week is a very long time in politics and a very, very, very long time in the politics of Brexit. But as a Brexiteer I do like the look of this. Anyway, what do you think? Please share and comment and... Thank you for watching. Please do like and share this video and also subscribe to my channel. And when subscribing, please do remember to press on the little bell next to the subscribe button. That way you'll get an alert every single time I put up a new video. Thank you very much for watching.